is that um, I wanted to work on the next screen with you guys and the next screen is simply to make some smoke come out of this uh, genie lamp and the bonus round simply for Cable Wonders is uh, you, the genie released uh, three wishes and how it's going to work is that it's going to follow the users through a journey and it's going to have three puffs of smoke here. So inside this I've already created um, my Photoshop file opened here and then what I'm going to do is simply create another layer and when you have that layer let's just actually put it into a folder we'll call it smoke one smoke one inside that smoke one here's this is the blank layer and I'm, what I'm going to do is just choose a smoke color that I would like and I'm going to choose a brush and I think I'm going to do something around 17 just something like this and we're just going to draw it into the shape that we want since I need three of them I kind of want it to come up this way and I'm actually going to change the brush strokes a little smaller so that there's more detailing in it so generally I want something like this and you can just draw whatever lines you want um, doesn't really matter because smoke is kind of random and we're going to be distorting this anyways um, just to give it also a little bit more flair I'm going to put some other colors in there just to make it a little bit more special. Okay, so once we have something that looks a little bit like this, we are going to go to the filter tab and then go to liquidify. And when you have liquidify here, make sure that your background, show background, is clicked off and it's behind. And we're just going to simply take the wrap tool and just push it around. Let's see here, let's make this a little bit bigger. That's probably too big. Um, so you just play around with this and this is the main step of how do you make smoke and it's not going to look like much but let's just get the general shape and it kind of mixed up. Here, do some funky things however you want. Pull it, you can pull it a little bit, it looks like it's coming out of there. And it doesn't look like much right now but so once you do this step you're just going to press OK and what we're after that we're going to go to the edit tab and then we're going to go to fade liquify and then what we're going to do is when we pull the opacity of this down you can see that the old version of it is actually in the background so we'll do this and then we'll leave it around 50% right now and then after this step here what we're going to do is actually go back and do the liquify once again so you'll see that the changes that I added in there were actually in here. So we're just going to flip, here we go, and just kind of massage it a little bit more because smoke is very random and I'll do that. And the more crazy you actually get, I find that the smoke actually looks pretty cool. So it looks like it's actually coming out of the genie lamp. Okay, I'll push that and see what happens there. We're going to go back here, back to edit window and then you see that the smoke on the screen has changed a lot. We're going to fade the liquify once again and you see the smoke is starting to take shape and it's starting to take form and then we'll, I kind of like round something like this and what I want to do is just do it one more time just so it looks um, a little bit better. So we're going to go to liquify. I'm going to do it right here because I kind of want the shape here because I'm going to put another thing of smoke right underneath it. I'm going to swirl it just a little bit more and I'm going to change my brush size just a little bit. There's other options here that you can play with too, like twirl um, and wave and you just play around with the different options. And then go back here, again repeat the process, go to fade liquify and there's my puff of smoke. And what I do here at this point, um, when, once you get the smoke that you like, we are going to go to adjustments and this is what I do. I like to use levels and curves and I change the color like so. So you can change um, the different saturation rates. So I hope that was helpful. And I hope you guys play this game on Lucky Lady Casino on Facebook when it launches uh, fall of 2014. Bye guys!